Doc on the Run. We help injured runners run. Hi, I'm Dr. Christopher Segler, and one of the questions I get frequently is, what is athlete's foot? What does athlete's foot have to do with toenail fungus? Because patients will call me and they'll say, I don't really care about the skin. I just want my toenails to look normal again. And if you want your toenails to look normal, you have to get rid of the fungus. That means the fungus in the nails and other sources as well. Athlete's foot is really nothing more than the same fungus that infects the toenails getting into the skin. You see these little peeling areas, circular areas, flaking areas where the skin has been peeling? That's athlete's foot. The fungus is growing in the skin, and as the fungus grows, the fungal filaments expand and they suck the moisture out of the skin, and that causes the dry peeling areas that you see as athlete's foot. And don't be fooled by the myths. Just because it doesn't itch or burn doesn't mean that you don't have athlete's foot. So if you have any little circular peeling areas on the bottom of the foot or between the toes, you need to address that. You've got to do something about it before you start treating the toenails. You have to make sure that the toenails don't get reinfected. Otherwise, if you go get a laser treatment and you kill the fungus in the toenails, the live fungus in the skin and the fungal spores in the skin will get back into the toenails and cause another toenail infection. And then you won't have success. You'll still have discolored toenails. So make sure that you treat the skin completely in order to get rid of all of the fungus in the skin before you try to treat the toenails. That's really important. Doc on the Run. We help injured runners run.